Hey, what's up, guys? I am Mr. Pyro, and today I'm giving you a tour of my server and a guide, and just something to help you out if you are not very familiar with servers. But first off, I'd like to thank the person who has been making all the music that's in my videos. Obviously, he's not making it for me, but you know, I really like it, and he deserves more fame, I think. So it's Grant Bowtie. The link will be in the description. It's actually what's playing right now in this video. It, the song is called Wonderland, which kind of fits the server, I guess. That's the only reason I chose this song. But um, so yeah, this is the spawn on, of my server. There is a parkour area at the top. It shows the first three winners. And right here, this is called the Tower of Terror. Nobody has completed this yet. The first one to complete it gets 200 diamonds. Um, I'll put a sign if somebody ends up completing it, but yeah. So yeah, the first one to get up here gets 200 diamonds, um, so that's that. Then there is the info center. Um, this is a new area, there's also a weather thing, so it, if it's raining it rains here a lot. Yeah, um, there's some cool info, if you want to see any of this right now, just pause the video. Anyways, um, I'll take you to the spawn point. Uh, also right here it says, don't be that player who wants peace, fight, because um, on servers that I've hosted in the past, uh, people tend to uh, not want to PvP when they go out into the war zone and they tend to like cry when they die and stuff. This is a hardcore PvP server, so if you die, like get, get ready to die and lose your stuff countless times. So over here we have the danger shop. So what this is, is pretty much it's a chest shop. Oh, there's a player over there. It's a chest shop for people to go to, but it's in the open world, it's in the war zone, so you can die, so you have to be really careful when you're here. And right here, there is some parkour to get up here to shoot people or whatever. I don't know, I was bored when I made that. Now right here, we have, uh, we have a little secret area right here. Um, over here, we have parkour to get up to the health pad. When you stand on it, it drops health potions on you. So this is like a health pad, so you can just regen. Right here, we have noob traps. If you step on those, you get trapped, and you have to type slash spawn because pistons pop up. Over here, we have this little water area which with a bridge, which kind of serves no real purpose. But uh, over here, we have a secret little area underwater where it teleports you up to the hot air balloon. So yeah, um, that there was a little bit of a delay because my internet's kind of pooping out today. But uh, here's a helipad one. Here's a helipad for that helicopter up there. There's a button on the side right here. Yep, and you can go out over here and go up here, get on top. You know, and then to to get down, you can just jump. Um, you can also shoot people from up there or up down over there. Uh, so now there's a secret little thing right here to shoot uh, snowballs. So that's cool to knock people off. And also there's one kind of like it right here with arrows. So when you stand right here, arrows shoot and knock players off. And that that's actually really lethal to some players. Um, right here there was a grief and I had to rule that it, it's really ugly. Um, there's a spawn base. This was not made by me. So, um, now that's gonna be pretty much it, unless you need to help with the commands. Um, now is gonna be a command section, so if you're not, if, you, if you're familiar with all the commands, you can just click off the video now. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. If Now, if you're still here, alright, I'm gonna help you with factions. Factions are really useful um for as of right now you cannot open chests in other factions claims which is a bug and i don't know why it's not working i'm trying to fix it but um so to create a faction you type f create oh you probably can't see the full screen pretty much what i'm typing is f create no slash f space create and then the faction name so whatever i want That'll make the faction. Um, you can't see it because I already have a faction. And then you can go out into the find this wilderness area and type F claim. 
And that'll claim it for you. Uh, it says your faction already owns this land. Weird. Anyways, um, so yeah. Oh, that must be because I am not in a faction. Anyways, you have power. So here, one second. F, create, staff. Now, you can set a faction description by typing slash F, space, desk, or description, and then you can type whatever you want, and that'll make it your tag. So when people are in your territory, it says that. And then also F, claim, to claim the land, and that will make it, like, grief proof. Not TNT, though. Stuff can still explode, but people can't, like, physically with their hand break blocks. Then you have F, unclaim. And uh, I'm going to show you, you have F power, you, uh, your max power is 10, your minimum, the most minimum is negative 10, so you don't want to be negative 10 of course. The, what power does is when you die you lose it, and if your whole faction together their power is combined, and if your power goes lower than the claimed land, then you can be, uh, enemy players can claim it from you, so they can steal it. Um, also, now the MCMMO portion, we have, oh, there's more, there's more fashion commands, but those are the basics. MCMMO is pretty much a, like, MMO type of thing, so it gives you, like, special stuff, like skills and whatnot. For example, you can now fight with axes really well, um, so axes are, like, really good. They have critical hit here, let's see, struck with great force. And they pretty much have levels too, so you level them up as you fight. Here, let's see. Alright. Here, gonna fix that. You level it up, my axes is 3000, because I just edited it. Because I don't PvP on this account. I have another account for that. I am Mr. Pyro. This one is LOL, oh, my name is Ben. This is the admin. Anyways, uh, there's axes, there's swords, which does stuff. Also, when you right click, you can activate. Um, skull breaker you can activate pretty much a special ability and when you use that special ability it like is really powerful for example axes if I'm not mistaken is like an AoE which means area of effect where it hits multiple targets swords the enemy will start bleeding um, there's tons of other skills like here MC top or no MC stats Alright, the, the stats are excavation, which pretty much gives you bonus stuff for digging. Fishing, which, yeah, kind of self-explanatory. You get higher chance of getting stuff and you can get cool treasures. Herbalism is for, like, farming in general or punching, like, flowers. Mining is for mining. You can get double drops, triple drops, and everything. Woodcutting, same thing. Axes is good for fighting with axes. Archery is there. Swords is that taming, you can get better at taming wolves. Acrobatics, which I really like. Acrobatics, when you level it up, you have a higher chance of rolling. And by rolling, it means like you don't take damage when you fall. And also there's a graceful roll. So when you hold shift while you're falling, it like has an even higher chance of rolling and it does less damage. And then there's repair, which I can explain right here. One second. You can get an iron block. And when a, you have a uh, weapon that is not very it, that loses its damage, like when it takes damage and it's almost broken, you can repair it here. And um, it takes you have to be level 50 to repair diamond gear. But just a heads up, it does. From last time I did it, it removes enchants. So if you have an enchanted gear or weapon or whatever else you're repairing, that's just. It might lose it. It takes a while for you not to break in chance, so be warned. Um, so I think that wraps everything up. Oh, wait. Also, if you want to apply for staff, I know there's been a lot of questions about applying for staff. If you want to apply for staff, you have to be on the server for at least a week, so sorry if you haven't been on the server that long. Um, if you have, well, good on ya. You can apply if you want. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I've said um way too many times in this video. I need to get better at that. But other than that, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.